And now, please welcome to the stage your co-founder and chief product officer, Hussein Basir. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone. I'm super excited to be here. We have done so many products that we're going to show you today. It's amazing. Let's get right into it. I want to start by talking about product development. This is our daily battle. Making the right product is often about identifying the right problem. Finding the right problem is finding the, the customer pain. It's all about your pain. And what we do is building the painkiller. Let's take a look at this chart. So on one end, you see satisfaction going up and down. And you have this other row of talking about attractiveness, performance, and things that are expected. And before I get into our products, let me give you an example about cell phones. Back in the day, when cell phones came out, everybody was super excited that they could just make a phone call. Today, you don't even make a phone call, do you? <laughs> you just send a text message, you send a picture, send an audio message. Things change very quickly, and we are the same. It happens to us the same way. So when Moonray came out in 2017, it was amazing to just print models chair side. We built in a custom DLP projector into it. And we had auto support generation. That was unheard of at the time. In 2019, we had to reinvent ourselves with Pro. It was much faster. We removed the tilt motor that nobody liked. 2021, we had to introduce Pro S. Even higher accuracy. AI automations. And it was even faster with kits. We introduced the kits, and many of you guys bought it, and you love it. But then again, not enough, right? What's next? We are in 2024. It really, Sprint Ray is in 2040, but let's, for the, for the sake of this conversation, we're in 2024. And don't you want all of these things? Faster prints, easier to use, higher resolution, more accuracy, maybe new platform for biomaterial innovation, future proofing, one printer for everything? We put everybody in a room and said, hey, you got to hit all these things. Everybody wants every single one of these things. And then boy, oh boy, they started getting to sketching, drawing, do all sorts of drawings, making sure that we take care of every single thing. And today, we're so proud to announce the next generation of Pro 3D printers. There you go. Woo! All right, it's right here. So yes, we're super excited about this guy. It's amazing, and it's powerful. It's asking for resin right now. Well, maybe later. <laughs> All right. So yes, this is the next generation dental workhorse that we have built, and we are super proud of it. And let me start by just going over some of the obvious features. Ergonomic handle, we heard you guys, <laughs> we, <laughs> it needs this. And I can't believe that we didn't do it before, but now it's there. <laughs> Woo -hoo. Done. We didn't stop there, obviously. <laughs> Next one, you can see this beautiful display, all glass. The entire thing is now a place for you to, to run automations and do many different things that were not possible before as well as having user guides and, and, you know, make this printer even more delegatable than before. Next up, once you open the lid, let me just do that right here, you're going to get to see the new build platform. We have remastered this build platform. The new electronics, now we have even better ways to detect these things and also open room for future kits that we're gonna build into it. Next piece, it's the new resin tank. It's all new and I'm gonna get into the details of that later. But then more important than anything else, what enables the system is a new resin curing system that we have built. Pro 2 is able to deliver 
35 microns pixel perfection. It's really, really maxed out resolution. Cannot get any better than that. Things look molded when they come out of the printer. In addition to that, again, for the very first time, you're putting 385 nanometer light engine on this machine, which just gives you, please, next generation accuracy that you have never seen before. Introducing all new optical panel. It's a patent pending by sprint ray. It's a new system to do masking. Let me tell you all about it. First of all, the 35 microns X and Y resolution is coming from this guy. And it's all around the platform. Imagine that. You have a full platform that goes 35 microns from corner to corner, pixel perfection. It has outstanding UV transmission, which allows it to print very fast. Onboard intelligence. So we have embedded electronics into this. This is not just a panel. It has electronics built into it. So it can track its lifetime and also give you information right from that touch screen. And it's also made to last. This thing is built like a tank. Optical panel is paired with the new light engine. This new light engine is able to deliver that 35 nanometer UVA. It has dedicated cooling because it's super high powered. We're actually only using 30% of its power. So imagine the future software updates that it's gonna unlock it, make it even faster. Only 30% right now. Fully enclosed, dust proof. Nothing gets inside of this. It's, it's on top of it, there's just big glass. And it also comes with this lifetime LED. So the, for, the, for the life of the printer, you don't have to do anything to this. Why? Because it has that dedicated cooling, it's enclosed, so it has this perfect environment to just live in the printer forever. But there's one more thing. It's also modular. You might be noticing, like, what are those things, right? You want to see what those are? Check this out. Through the life of this printer, you may have to upgrade it. You may have to replace the optical panel. It's that easy. Anybody can do it. So now your printer is self-serviceable, tool-free. Everything is built into the printer. You pull it out, you pull a new one in, the printer detects it and understands that there's a new optical panel. Isn't that cool? But then again, let's, let's just bring it all together. What does it mean at the end of the day? You're super proud of this particular stat. Look at this. Standard deviation is now plus and minus 23 microns. This is a new gold standard in dentistry. <laughs> One of the most accurate things we've ever done. <laughs> it's amazing. Just to compare with ProS, this number is four times better. So if you own a Pro S, this printer is already four times better than that right from the get-go. Let's talk about the digital dashboard that we built into it. We love to put great screens on these things because <laughs> it just gives another level of love when you're using it. You, know, you want to you wanna have a product that you love using. So we gave it this beautiful dashboard with 12-inch ultra-wide touchscreen. It's double the width of Pro S. Imagine what you can do with that. All the AI automations, everything is going to come to this. USB Type C, we live in future. Let's change that. Let's go to USB Type C for fast data transfer. And finally, what the heck is that in the corner turning on right now? That is a barcode scanner. So this thing is going to help you scan the resin barcode. It will track the expiry date of the resin once it assigns it to the resin tank. It's gonna keep the lot number. It's just gonna retain all this information that is important as a medical device manufacturer and, and you guys as a producer of the medical device. So you can refer back to it. You can go back to the history of what you printed. You can figure out what it was printed with. For any reasons you have to do that, it's now right on it. It also helps with assignment of resin to resin tank as we have done it before. A 
printer, for everything. It's fast and accurate. It's ready for all the biomaterials that we have introduced in the past few years, and past few months, past few weeks, because very, we are very fast, and also whatever comes in the future. And it's supercharged by kits. So that lesson we learned from introducing the kits, we brought it back to Pro2. Here, there's a new resin called Dental Model Resin, and check it out, at 170 microns, you can go to print, finish a print in eight minutes. Isn't that cool? Building retainers, doing any sort of wax up, anything very quick, amazing. This resin will be available in Q3, and it's gonna just supercharge the speed of the printer. Next up, hybrid dentures. Now we can get to a hybrid denture in 19 minutes. I think I'm covering this. Let me just move out of the way. 19 minutes, hybrid dentures with the arch kit. Imagine the speed of delivery of this appliance. Now it changes everything. And because of how accurate this printer is, clean screw channels, passive fit every time, guaranteed. Beautiful. Next, surgical guides, 17 minutes at 100 microns. Precise and clear. It will fit just right in. Occlusal guards. Now we can go to occlusal guards, upper and lower in 15 minutes. Very fast. Removable dentures, 20 minutes and 40 minutes, respectively for the denture teeth and then for the denture base. Crisp and sharp details are now possible. Dr. Wally, Wally Rene does a lot of festooning. Those are gonna show up just right on, the, right on the model itself. Cemented restorations from 12 minutes. So now ArchKit is gonna replace Crown Kit for the Pro 2 so you can go still print things very fast. Do any sort of restoration you want from, from shell temps, from crowns, inlay onlays, veneers, very fast. So this is Pro 2. It's enabled by optical panel. It delivers precise prints all around the platform with 385 nanometer light engines. 35 microns X and Y resolution all around the platform. Fast print speeds, supercharged with kits, and a new platform for biomaterial innovation. And we are so excited that we are going to be able to ship it in June. <laughs> Woo!